Jews with the mediation of Russia, Azerbaijan and Armenia have announced peace agreement. War has come to an end. Uh, now when I'm recording this video, peace agreement, ceasefire agreement has already come into force. Official announcements have been made by the President of Azerbaijan and Prime Minister of Armenia regarding this peace agreement. Uh, viewers, what are the key features of this peace agreement? What does this agreement hold for Azerbaijan and Armenia? Firstly, uh, in the early 1990s war between Azerbaijan and Armenia, Armenia captured seven regions of Azerbaijan. Uh, Jabrail, Fazuli, Zanjilan, Kubadli, Lachen, Kalbajar and Agdam. These seven regions are Azerbaijani territories. They are not part of nagorno karabakh -Yos. Azerbaijani forces had already captured four regions in the ongoing war, Jabrail, Fazuli, Zanjilan and Kubadli. Remaining three territories, uh, Kalbajar, Lachin and Agdam, they will also be returned by Armenia to Azerbaijan. Uh, Agdam will be returned uh, till uh, 20th of November viewers. Then uh, Kalbajar till 15th of November and Lachin till 1st of December. So all seven territories which were under the control of Armenia, which were part of Azerbaijan, Azerbaijan is getting back all these seven territories. First important point and the major victory for Azerbaijan. Secondly viewers, Nagorno-Karabakh territory, Stepanakert, uh, then uh, places like Khojavend, what will be the fate of proper Nagorno-Karabakh areas? This area, it will remain under the control of Russian peacekeepers viewers and a transport link will be constructed between Armenia from Lachin to Stepanakert. So the area Nagorno-Karabakh, much of this area, it will remain linked to Armenia and Russian peacekeepers will be deployed along the line of contact between Nagorno-Karabakh and Azerbaijan and Armenia and Nagorno-Karabakh. Around 2000 Russian servicemen will be deployed here and they will be deployed for a period of five years. Then this uh, period of five years, it will be renewed and Russian peacekeepers, they will remain in this area. So old uh, Nagorno-Karabakh area, it will be linked with Armenia. What will be the status of this area? Will it be uh, semi-autonomous or part of Armenia? It is not mentioned in this agreement. But the link of the, this area with Armenia, it will be ensured by the forces of Russia. Shushi viewers. Shushi will stay with Azerbaijan. Azerbaijani forces captured Shushi. And Shusha or Shushi, uh, Azerbaijan is called Shusha. So Shusha city will remain with Azerbaijani forces. Fourthly views, transport link between Nakhchivan through Armenia uh, towards uh, Azerbaijan, it will also be provided by Armenia and it will be protected by Russian border security forces. In other words, if I sum up this agreement, definitely a success from Azerbaijani point of view. They have retaken their seven territories, Zanjilan, Kubali, Jabrail, Fazuli, Lachin, Kalbajar and Agdam. But disputed area, Nagorno-Karabakh, uh, much of this area, it will be under the control of Russian peacekeepers uh, who will be joined by Turkish peacekeepers as well. And transport link uh, from Lachin towards Stepanakert, it will also be ensured. It will be constructed within three years and uh, Russian forces, they will ensure the security of this link between Armenia and Stepanakert.